Yo, what is up guys? And in today's video I'm building some traps for Squeaky and she's trying to kill me. So I've made a little tunnel to kind of just get that out of the way. And to build traps in this, what I normally go for, because we play this loads off camera, it's one of my favourite games. Is I'll break these bits here. And then I won't say the item because Squeaky is in the room with yeah, me. But I just put these there. And I bet you can kind of guess roughly where it's going from here, but if not, then I'll show you when it's done. Okay, guys, so this is what's going on here. So it's a whole array of these. And yep, I just cover it all up here. So... They just don't exist now. Yeah. I'll TP. And then you push it out to here. And then we'll go this way. A bit of light would be useful. Okay, don't look what I'm doing. So you can figure out that these are two blocks away. So then obviously using that simple maths. Go through here. Okay, Squeaky's here. She's not going to look at me or at my screen. Well, I can see you. Okay, try not to look at me so you don't see what I'm doing. I'll get those in the dust. Okay, maybe go like out the hole almost. That might be a good spot. Okay, so we fling this here. My question is... Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the levers. My question is, does this... It does power that one. It should also... Does not power that. It does that. Ah. Fix. I'll go like this. It only powers that. Okay. That should be alright. Because the... Okay. That's powered. So we'll take this through the floor. Go along this. And then... This is obviously just a repeat. Just to make sure it goes the whole way. Okay, yeah, you can see. So that does go the whole way. So we just flick. That's all gone. Okay. Squeaky, would you mind reading the coordinates? Okay. Yep, yep. Minus 63. Okay, thankfully, guys, Squeaky is very kind. And she will read out the coordinates. So I'm going to use it to kill her. Wait, well, partially, yes. Yeah, Yep, Squeaky was fully aware that that would be used to kill her totally. didn't think it was just something. Like that. I do need to fill all this in manually by hand, but it's creative mode, so it's fine. Okay, guys, we've made good progress. I think we've just got these two bits here. and it's sh Oh, no, we've got a lot more. Good news, guys. We are now fully 100% complete with this first step. All we've got to do is grab some of these guys here. Put them in our inventory. And just to 100% confirm, death will happen. And now with just a flick of a singular lever, it's all gone. I'll be not... Okay, well. There we go. Perfect. I feel like Squeaky won't fall for this. I feel, I feel like she'll dig around it or something the second she... Because that was going on. Okay, guys, I think you can probably figure out what this is. But obviously, to make sure these are all source blocks, we fill it up with some kelp. Great to help you replace it with soul sand. Well, something's gone horribly wrong. Okay, hopefully that. Oh, it's because of thingy, isn't it? Yeah, it's because I uh, broke this place or something. Okay, guys, the next part of the trap will probably lie about here. And I'm going to dig just down a little bit to a few layers of stone and have that so you don't take full damage. And then this one's going to fall slightly differently. So what I'm going to do is we're going to dig up like that, you see. 
and then boom. So we're going. So you may be wondering why have you dug another block up, and I'll show you that in just a second. So we're going to fill this up, but we need one key item, that thing that makes this all deadly. No TNT involved. Oh. Oh. So unfortunately this one won't be able to do anything. So we're going to have to. And then I need to hook it all up first. So I can close this and don't just but kill myself. Okay and then we. And then what we're going to do. Is build this staircase that's got. A lever here. Pushing all that shut. I Okay, I'm going to need to slightly push back my lever and staircase to... Okay, I finished my build. So, yep, I can jump. And hopefully Squeaky is not right on my tail. Okay, so hopefully that all works according to plan. If not, then that's kind of bad. Okay guys, so I do build one more trap, but I reckon you've probably already seen enough of me building. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you that when we get to it later on in the video. Okay guys, Squeaky is now ready, so we are going... She also built that, so that's cool. Uh, sorry. Uh, I get a five second head start, so one, two, three, four, five. That was probably less than five seconds, but it's fine. So Squeaky, I feel like it's going to be very prepared. Hey Squeaky, come down this completely non-suspicious corridor I built for you. Oh, I, I thought you walked forward then. So, um, yeah, Squeaky can't really do much. Oop, are you going to walk forward? Yep, that's totally a trap. She doesn't realise if she just walks along my pistons. Oh, I just thought. I can tell exactly where she is by the redstone she's... She's approaching me dangerously. Okay, up the bubble elevator we go. Oh, look, I get to run through my sign. She built me. Okay. Now we've got some ground on her. I went far. I went too far. Hey, Squeaky. Look up. I don't know what Squeaky's plan is. No, she survived. Run. Probably down the hole. Look in the cave. There's a big hole with water at the bottom you can jump down into. Down the hole you go. And she died to fall. She didn't even go down the hole. She died to full damage. If you went, if you went all the way down the hole, Squeaky, look. It was a void trap. Okay, guys, so I did win. Instead of using the animation, I found I'm gonna use Squeaky's back sign because it's really nice. And if you did enjoy, please let me know with a like and a down below, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.